Okay. Hi. Hello. I'm finally back. Back again. Uh, so I took Friday off. I was just feeling kind of lethargic. And the sleep schedule got a little bit messed up over the weekend, I gotta be honest. I took a sleeping pill in an attempt last night to kind of reset things a little bit so I could get up in like late morning. But it had the side effect of making me sleep until 1pm, so, you know, not great. But it gave me plenty of time before streaming, I guess. So, you know, it could be worse, I guess. I'll try to drag it back a little bit over the course of this coming week. So, anyway, uh, as anyone who reads the notification might already know, Today, I want to grind up a bit so I can actually defeat Sabrina. I kind of previewed her in the gym last night. Rather, not last night. Last time I streamed. Last Wednesday. And after that, I kind of want to check out the underground arena, which I think is like... Kind of like the battle tower or something, you know? Like, competitive NPC trainers that you fight against. I don't think I'm going to stand any chance against it, but maybe I can beat, like, low-level ones. And it's good to get the points, but it's a good trade event for stuff, I think. Like the, uh, the gold and silver leaf items, you can get them in like packs there, I guess, so that'd be nice. So let's see, um, our star players for the Serena fight, it was mostly faster, I want to say. Donald was kind of nice too, but I guess we should try to get them all leveled up a bit, these three specifically. I, I love Sully and Cindy, I want to be able to actually use them, but it's, it's going to take a bit, you know? I don't know. Um. Maybe I should put the XP share on one of them, just so... Hmm. Yeah, it can't hurt, I guess. Let's try to kind of balance out the team a bit. Like, we're, we're going into things tonight. Ready to grind. As, like, our goal. It's not just, like, an unfortunate side consequence. It's what we're actually doing tonight. That's fine, I guess. Um, so a good gym to grind on, I think, maybe Surge. Since Bast are going to one-shot pretty much anything in there. Though we're probably going to want to switch around to different gyms based on, um... Yeah, actually, you know, since Dinkachu is the lowest out of these main three, I'm going to start off at Faulkner's gym, I think. I don't think anything there is too ridiculous. If I go too high I, in the difficulty setting, I think he might get a Zapdos, which isn't great. But, well, we'll deal with that if it happens. I can't go too high anyway, because, um... Stink is usually only about like 47, 48. Let's see if we can get this about right. Where's the gym here? But this is the right place, right? Yeah, it's Falcon. Okay, good. Make sure I'm not accidentally at Bugsy's place. That's Azalea though. Okay, let's crank this up. Oh, okay, yeah. I'll just cancel the other one. Was that Blaine? I forget. I started one and then. Examine it again. I'm done. Mm -hmm. Challenge. Uh, let's do set 11. We'll try that. Stink 2 is pretty strong. Even if something's got like a good 6 8 level advantage on him, he can probably take it if it's weak to electric. But I'm not totally sure. We'll see. Give me that cave story music. I love it. Give your own. Should be straightforward enough. It's only level 45 actually, maybe we put it on higher. It's not much, but it's because the others are getting some of the XP share, so it's fine. We gotta share the love a bit, you know. Uh, we'll switch to Donald for the Gligo for obvious reasons. Secret ground type. Why is it ground type? I'm not really sure. What is Gligar? Like a cross between a flying squirrel and a bat? I'm kind of unsure actually. I've never really thought too much about it. Like scorpion? So that's why it's part ground type? I don't know. Please tell me. Melt well, right now, it's just fodder though. Stinkachu, we're prioritizing the lower levels. I don't think any of the ones we're racing up can handle anything in here, regardless of types, really. We're gonna need to get them some TMs anyway, I think. 
be tutor some egg moves so we can get more DMs. So I assume that the underground arena is based around level 50. So anything above level 50 will probably get leveled down, right? But I don't know if ones below 50 will get leveled up. Really. Oh, and I believe you also need to have your Pokemon be fully evolved unless you like tweak the settings down there. So that won't be a problem for some of my party. For the weaker ones it'll be an issue. But they're not exactly battle ready anyway. You probably don't get EXP down there. So it's just like for the points, for the clout, the rewards that you can trade in or using the points. Can't trade the clout for anything. If only. I do love this song, but I feel as if maybe it should change it up to something else because I've heard it quite a few times over the course of this this hack, for sure. I'm not going to say that I'm sick of it, because I'm not, but it's like, more variety would be good, you know? I'll take a couple songs again after this. Surely I won't forget, right? Oh, and I did throw around the idea of grabbing a dark type for Sabrina's gym, and just to have. Uh, so there weren't too many options. You know, there's Murkrow, there's Houndoom, I believe is Fire Dark, and there's Tyranitar's line, which is Dark Rock. I think I found out. Hmm. I almost want to see who can trade for a Larvitar from one of the game centers. Maybe I should just go through that a look before I get too invested in this. I'll finish Falcon's Gym first, though. I have enough Poké Dollars that I think I could just trade for coins. I should just quick attack that poor thing. Put it out. Zapdos. Mm, it's gonna be awkward if he does. I'm not totally sure how I'm going to want to approach that yet. I mean, yeah, technically Stinkachu doesn't have a bad matchup against it, it's just neutral. But faster can't really do too much as far as ground type is concerned. I can do it with rock stuff. Um, I mean, I guess they'll have good defensive matchups, right? But I'm sure it's gonna know like a silly move too. I don't know if flying stuff. Shit, it has it. Okay. Um. Does Faster still have a rock type move? Let's find out, I guess. I'm kind of unsure. He's gotta have something that's not ground type, right? Yeah, so he's got a couple. Okay. Uh, we can use Rock Slide. So we have speed. That's a good start. I don't think this move is that strong, but let's see how it does. Not bad. Three hits, so that'll be enough. He's using fly. Um, don't think we can take a hit from that. Which isn't great, but... Papyrus has kind of served his duty. Like, for him to be a level 40 is all I really care about. Rather, uh, like, wh whatever level he needed to be at for false swap, right, is the important thing. As that, he's kind of done his job, you know? I can pulse whip stuff with him, as long as I'm not trying to catch something that's like a 50 or 60, and I'll just be okay. I'm not really concerned with him losing out some EXP in this fight. Maybe faster could have taken a hit from that? I don't know. His defenses are just so low. Oh, that's nice. Um, yeah, it's just gonna keep using fly though, so... There's no point switching out yet. There's no way to switch out without taking a hit and still be able to actually do a hit back, so. Good. Uh, is it gonna drop from that burn? I think I'm really close. Okay, um, I'm gonna switch out to Donald here. 
I think that burn's gonna take it out now, right? It's burn 160. I'm unsure of that. Okay, good. Otherwise, I would've had to switch out for another stall because it would've used something on the trick here. Nice. This bee got really spread around, but that's fine. Alright, back up to Stinkachu. So we can deal with Zapdos. I mean, I gotta say though, that burn was really lucky. That would have been a lot harder otherwise, we might have had to sack one or two. Rock Slide did pretty good damage, but still three hits is three hits. I wonder if maybe Faster could have survived one hit from Fly. If he was strong enough to two hit KO it, and he could survive a hit, that wouldn't be that bad, but I'm not totally sure. Another Gligar. Ah, oh, Falconer, come on. Just, just let people counter your gym with one type, why don't you? You don't gotta go and be a jerk. This beam's good. This is four times weakness. Surface stab and single times weakness, so this should be more... More damage. Cool. Dodrio. Uh, yeah, sure. We'll, we'll switch again. Dodrio is flying type despite not flying, right? I think. Flying in normal? I'm not, I'm not really sure. Silly little try attack. Ooh, actually that is pretty strong. I didn't think that would do so much. Huh? Uh, okay. Let's bring up Donald. Let's see what you can do here. Just surf on it, really. Ouch. Mm, it's not great. It's not gonna be able to take another hit. Um. But I'm just going to have to sacrifice him here. Faster, but shoot off. There's no point switching unless I switch to another Pokemon on the sacrifice, so. Alright. We'll just uh, rock slide, I think. That's the best bet here. Steel interact. Um, if I could. Um, Skarmory is pretty slow, but is it slow enough that I can actually hit it? It's not a very offensive Pokemon, right? Unless it's built to be one, I guess. Steel Wave might hurt. I don't know. The virus is so low level, though, that he probably can't hit first. But I'm gonna try to heal up if I have heals. I don't. Okay. Oops. Fly. Why does everything here have to not fly? Alright, well, we're just gonna lose Papyrus then. I wanted to hit it with Fire Punch. I guess that was uh, too much to expect. Fair enough. Alright, let's hope that Faster can do this. Rock Slide. So it's neutral. It resists it, it's not good. This thing might actually just take us out here. Um, I guess I can use sub. Guess that's good against fly, isn't it? Mm, is Rock Sash gonna be better? How does fighting interact with steel? Let's see. So it's neutral, but it still does way less, and that's a shame. Well, this is my best bet here, to get a few hits in at least, but it's not going to be enough. Hmm. Yeah, I'm, I'm just kind of stuck here. 
Do I have any revives left? Is it even worth using one? I mean, I probably have more money on me than the cost of a revive, right? So it probably is worth it. Um, I guess I'd want to bring faster back up, right? Thunderbolt it. Steel might resist, um, thingy, I'm unsure. Uh, I don't know if I can make another sub, by the way. I'm unsure. Probably not, right? But I'll try it in its turn anyway, since there isn't really any harm. because of how the HP runs, right? Cool. Yep, I can get another hit in, that's nice, I guess. Oh, no, never mind, I actually can't. That's a shame, bad luck. Alright, enough of the formalities, just take me out then. You did good work faster, you tried your best. Great, is it? Um, I can also fly. I'm faster, so I don't want to do that until next turn, though. Um, I'm gonna try to Thunder Wave. Good. Okay. I actually have a big advantage here. Because I also have fly. I definitely want to bring up the Stinky Tree for Skarmory. I'm assuming it's good to use. Oh, jeez. I didn't think I'd do that much. Okay. I thought it would take a couple hits. I thought maybe Steel would resist it. Cool. That's that's the battle, right? That's all six. Flame wheel. Uh, it's not really that good, is it? Um, sure, though. You've got like even trashier moves right now, so why not? I'll take it. My dad's cherished bird Pokemon. Really need to get some healing items soon. Alright, um, let me heal up real quick. Let me go check a couple things. Um, so let me go over to Goldenrod. I'll grab some healing items, some lemonade from the department store. Maybe get some TMs for the rest of my party. And also check the game corner. That's right. So there's a game corner in Goldenrod, and in uh, wherever it is in Kanto. Other place. So, I believe they have different stocks of Pokemon. Let me check this one first, since I'm kind of here. Up to the top, please. Give me some drinkies. How much cash do I have on me right now? Find out. Here's the money. Oh, we have quite a lot. Good. Maybe not really enough to get a good selection of TMs, though, but... Well, it's a start. There's some Heelys, at least. So I'm drinking my own fresh water when I buy these. I wish I had some lemonade, though. Soda pop. I'm not drinking too much soda today. I've destroyed my teeth enough over the years. I used to be a total soda addict as a kid and teenager, but I'm just off the stuff now. I don't even really keep it in the house whenever possible. You know how some people like, uh, drink alcohol socially? I do that with soda. Like, if I go to a party, sure, I'll have a soda if there's one there, but I avoid the stuff otherwise. I'm a cocky guy now. Which probably also isn't very good for my teeth, but, well. Trust me, it's hopeless for my teeth at this point. There's no point betting anything on them anymore. Don't even have all of them, all of them left. One more. I 
think I'll put the TM thing off until another time, since that was pretty much all the cash I had on me. And I know that a lot of good TMs are like 10k, so I'll just wait. I'll bring back a bunch of uh, money another time. Let me go look at the game corner. Which is somewhere here. Is that it? Yes. What non book under the stuff? Uh, stuff do they have here again? I know I got the XP shirt from one of these. More candy. Buttons, Master balls. That's cool. Huh. Okay. Hmm. Good to know. So, what's your Pokemon selection? Hmm. You have Sneasel. Which is dark type, but I don't really know how good Sneasel is. On its own. Think about it though. But I think I want to go check the other game corner instead. Every time I have to look for Stinkachu so I can fly. Alright, uh, where's the game corner again? Celadon, right? I think it's in Celadon. Or is it in Saffron? Saffron, isn't it? Um, where's the gym? Yeah, I think it's... Unless it's here. Oh, okay, it is here. Cool. Okay, so this is the item corner, right? The item counter. So you got some different stuff here, somewhat. Okay. Don't really want any of that right now. I think candies later might not be that bad, though. Yeah, I thought so. There is a lot of retire here. Hmm. 1500, huh? This is paper, see. Huh, okay. Sure. Great thing. Alright, let me go get some money. sure how much I'm gonna need. I'll get 30k. I don't think I'll need that much, but, well, won't hurt. Maybe I'll grab an item or two or something, I'm not sure. I'm assuming that both the game corners have the same coin for poke dollar trade ratio, right? Hope so. Sure would. So I could buy 1700 basically. I'll just do it. It's fine. Okay. I wonder if you guys can hear the cat outside in the room. She's trying to get to my wife's room. But my wife is doing class right now, so not happening. She'll just have to deal. It's not gonna let me pick it up. Hold on. Ugh. Uh, where's the center? Here we go. Mm -hmm. I just can go for now. went to the trouble of getting him just for false swipe, and I've only caught like two Pokemon after that, I think. The ones that are in my party right now. Wrong house. I don't call it a house, but wrong building. Mm, got basically enough for this, right? Rock skin. 159 pounds, that little thing. Well, I guess if it were like mostly rock, that'd be legit, huh? Goodness, I have even thought of a good name. Uh, let's see. Lavos, it is. I 
the destroyer. Uh, and also have some coins left over for something here. That'll be enough, right? Okay, is there more than that? Okay, that's fine. What level does he come at? Probably not one. Five. Okay, well that's not much better. Okay. Hmm. Take off one of the XP shares, I guess. Move it over to him instead. Um, yeah, we want Sully to be leveled up. Because we have Claire left as one of the remaining gems. So we're definitely gonna want Ice type for dragons. For sure. You can take the other one and start leveling up as well. A little Q to you. Okay. So, let's see. Maybe we should just go back and do Faulkner again? Hmm. That Zapdos is a pain, but I think it'll be fine. If I need to, I can actually just abuse Fly and Stink at you, can't I, to beat that? Probably. So Faulkner is just go right straight back there then. Through the wall, though. Hmm, I could turn it up to 12, but I don't really think that's a good idea yet. Maybe once Tikachu hits 50, is 49 right now? 48. Soon, though. I mean, I've beat Faulkner a couple times now. I think I'm good enough. I had to just show you the badge. You know, the proof that I've already been here and done this. Babe's just gotta keep bullying me. Just bullying me every time. I forgot about the cave story music. Every time. This stuff always slips in my mind. Now this will be a good bump for a lot of us at least. Two levels right up. Third after this, right? And just swap up the down like four times. Yon by Yon by Jacques Den. Technically, it's a double weakness now, four times weakness. It's just four times damage. So Yon by Danji. And just Mi by Jacques Den. Labos, so I can get him a bit of extra XP here. And we've got the Stinkachu after. Stinkachu can take a hit, he's got lefties. Oh, I forgot how cute Larvitar's Cry was. Too bad he becomes an absolute Kaiju. Shot it or waste time. Uh, I knew it. It's always waste time. Oh, good. Keep her once. Yeah, I've gotten plenty lucky in this run. Freezing Misty Star on me was pretty nice. Matching point would have taken a few more tries otherwise. Or grinding. Great. Oh, level 11, no. You skip from 9 to 11 without even mentioning 10, or did I just scroll through it? That's odd. Oh, it was because I got two bursts of EXP, right? For being in the battle and for me, to be sure. That makes sense. I forgot the music again. Oh, 
regarding the whole situation with my capture card. Um, so we called up UPS today, and they said it might be lost. So they said to open up a claim. Couldn't do it through the site since... Uh, what, what's coming out here? Is that a Glyagor? I don't know. Mercury, okay. Uh, we, so we couldn't do it through the site because we weren't the ones who made the shipping label. That was Elgato. So we had to call them back up and do it manually. And I noticed, like, as soon as I gave the guy all the info and he, like, started the claim, suddenly, on the tracking page, it updated to say that the package was in California. I live in New York, by the way. California is the destination. So it's not there yet, but it's apparently at their facility. So it says. I don't really know how legit that is, because it was literally the exact minute. Uh, I asked the guy on the phone about it, because I was still on with him. He said he doesn't really have access to the information, so he doesn't know what it's about. Um, so they said wait one to eight days for them to do their investigation. But maybe they don't need to? I'm a bit confused, but I just want them to get the capture card back so I can get another one. This has been such a hassle. Big series of unfortunate events, really. Sure am, Faulkner. Faulkner. But as someone said, a certain PC emulator also runs the Switch game I'm looking to uh, play. The Toho RPG Devote Decline. Uh, rather perfectly, apparently, so I might resort to that if that time comes. I'm unsure. I mean, after and over with Crystal Clear, the two games I was interested in playing on stream are uh, Pokemon Puppet, and uh, not Pokemon, yeah, Toho Puppet Dance Performance, or wh whatever the whole name thing's called. Toho Nigo and the, I believe. Uh, wh what's he bringing out? I really need to pay attention. I'm just gonna assume it's Gligar. No, oh no, it's Aphthos. What have I done? What have I done? Uh... If you wanted to send it out second, just lead with it at that point. Eh, not great. Okay, it's, it's gonna use an electric move, right? So I can switch out safely? Okay, good. I'm glad that the AI can't cheat, at least there. Has to pick its move. Uh, anyway, so, Puppet Dance Performance, nice crit, by the way. Wow, it flinched, lucky. And Double Decline. Um, I'm thinking I might actually play both concurrently. I'm kind of unsure. I'll admit, the one I'm more excited for is Double Decline. Um, since, you know, Pokemon is Pokemon, even with a Toho skin on it. And I really like Genius of Superior the equal, kind of, to Devil of Decline. But, I don't know. I could also do them as, like, one at a time B-sides, kind of like I'm doing with Crystal Clear right now. Though, for the past couple streams, I haven't actually done an A-side. Like, a Toho shmup or something. So, I could make Devil of Decline my A-side and have Puppet Play be my B-side. I'm, I'm undecided. I kind of don't really want to wait super long to play Devil Decline. I think I'm going to want to play it as soon as I get the capture card, honestly. But, I might start Puppet Dance Performance before then, because I might not have the capture card by the time I'm finished with this, so... Well, I kind of slot it in then, you know? I didn't see what he was setting out as Pidgeot, maybe? Here, okay. Got it, that's fine. He does still have a Glider in there, though. That, I'm sure of. Yesterday, I grabbed this uh, Steam game called Nuts and gave it a try. It was a friend recommended it to me, not because they played it, because it looked like the kind of thing I'd like. And from the aesthetics, it really did. It's got like, um, I don't really know how to describe the like thing it does with its colors, but it looks kind of like games like Antichamber, or that, um, that one other puzzle game I streamed a while ago but didn't save the vlogs of. Or like, um, bright washed out, like, single color 
sort of things. Um, so the aesthetic on the game had been sold already. So I, I just bought it straight up. It wasn't really that great. Like, it was okay. But the whole gimmick was like, set down cameras so you can follow squirrels back to their, their nests, essentially. But the game was pretty short. There wasn't like any kind of big twist at the end like I thought there'd be. Uh, I didn't really read too much of the store page because I didn't want any potential spoilers going in. But I think it did say, like, solve the mystery. And the mystery wasn't really much of a mystery. There, there was no, like, big bug snacks to your twist or anything. And I really wish there had been. So I beat it in three and a half hours, and that was that. Not really worth 20 bucks, in my opinion. Um, but the... The game was nice, visually. Decent atmosphere. I got a little bit, um... What's the word? Immersed into it. But it kind of wore off quickly. Not really something I personally recommend, all in all. Unless you really like squirrels. What else have I played recently? Um, so I've recently played through the Toehole, rather the Bowlehole series that Dylan, Asprey and Matt, FM, is playing through. Um, so I started playing the first one, Bullhole Quorn Kill. Let's go with family. Got kind of fed up with it after a couple hours, and I figured I was going to drop it. So I went to check out the second game, and uh, that's Bullhole Yomu, so he plays Yomu instead. And the perfect cherry blossom past is there in the game. I rather enjoyed that quite a lot, actually. Um, it took me maybe 8-10 hours to beat it. 100%. So after that, I went back and played Kolmakyo and 100% of that as well. I still don't like it nearly as much as Yoyomu. But it wasn't a bad game. It just didn't really hook me the same way. There's one more game in the series, Kolmakyo 2. Boho Kolmakyo 2, rather. Um, like a direct sequel to the first one, I guess. Same cast, more or less. I don't know which game it's going to tend more after. I assume the first, since, you know, multiple political characters instead of just Yama. I hope that it takes some of the second games and lessons. I know that the, th that the third game finally has rapid fire for your shot, which is definitely appreciated. There's a lot of unnecessary tapping in the first two games, especially the first one. In the second game, you can upgrade Yomu's weapon to a Sword Slash instead, which isn't as bad. You don't have to mash quite as much because your, uh, your shot essentially reaches them instantly as soon as you hit the button. So if it kills them, you don't need to hit the button again. But with normal bullets, you might keep shooting it until the enemy's dead for sure. So you'll fire extra ones that'll miss, essentially. Like, preemptively, assuming that it'll take more hits. Trying the gym on 12 this time. Because my hopes are so dry. Ugh. My body is just so messed up. Allergies, awful teeth, and dry lips my whole life. I, I know other people have it worse, you know. I'm not like wheelchair bound or anything, thankfully, but. Jeez. I can still complain about these things, right? Yeah, which is especially. I am going to be getting those checked out soon. As I decided last stream, I talked to my wife about it. We just need to get our taxes done first and see if we're in the same um, income bracket for health insurance and all that. So that'll kind of determine what gets done there. I do intend to go and have that, which is looked at kind of soon. For your life would be really nice. I don't know if it's totally feasible or not, but I'd like to ask a professional to find out. Ooh, okay, I should have done that. It's unnecessary. I'll speed that thing anyway. I don't really know why I bothered. I'll heal up a little bit after this one. I would just go to the center since it's free, but honestly, like. 350 Pokedollars is nothing. 
I'm just gonna heal for the lemonade. I really don't care. It's fine. Hopefully I have enough PP though. No, that was just the first trainer. Wait, no, that guy had like more Pokemon than usual, didn't he? I don't think he usually has this car already. For one thing. It's fine though. I'll heal up. If we need the center after that strainer, we'll go back to the center. It's all good. The keyword is guts. Eat the guts of an immortal to also become immortal. Rod. You got anything new this time? ever get like a gen 3 or 4 or just like early gen period hack that like incorporates all the Pokemon from all the way to gems. Not gems, gens. It'd be really cool, for example, like let's say I was doing Faulkner's gym. And like I rank it up another tier like this. And like they bring out bird Pokemon from like Gen 7 or Gen 8. The thing is with only two gens, there's only so many surprises you can really pull on your players, you know? Sure, Zapdos Iowals is kind of cool, but what if you could bring out, uh, I don't know, Water Pokemon, um, I don't know, Unpheasant or something. It's not very exciting, I know, but maybe a Bird Gym isn't the most exciting thing in the first place, right? Thing is, though, you'd need to go at least up to Gen 5 for all the, the, the stuff, right? Like. I think Gen 5 is when hidden abilities got introduced, is that right? I don't think that was Gen 4, I think it was 5. So if you don't go up that far, like, you're kind of missing out on some stuff. And then you'd probably want to backport the ability patch and ability capsule too, right? At least maybe. It'd be nice. Center after this, no doubt. What type is Togetek in Gen 2? Just normal flying or just flying? I know later on it gets a fairy. The whole line does, I think, but it doesn't exactly exist here. Okay, we'll just ice beam this thing. I'm just kind of naively assuming that all the Pokemon in Gen 2 that get evolutions in later gens, like Murkrow and Sneasel, are kind of underpowered in Gen 2 and not really worth using. I could be totally wrong on that. I have no clue. But maybe I should have gotten a Sneasel instead as a dark type. Okay, let me go get back up. Let me get kind of wrecked a little bit there. place. don't really want to go in there. We haven't gotten many levels so far on our stronger ones. I know that maybe I should take out the XP share, but like, the weaker ones are going to need that XP eventually anyway, right? So why not just get it done now while grinding? There's anything flawed with that, really. This party is probably going to be all the same Pokemon, right? It's stronger. I mean, with the Zapdos, he's got like a the end gaming party already, I would think. Can I still one shot these? I hope so. Otherwise, those hits they do are going to build up quick. Oh boy. Oh boy. Okay, that that's fine. I can just cheese this then if it's going to fly on me. I bet like everything in this gym knows fly. Zapdos does, the Skarmory does, and we know that Pidgeot does. What here isn't gonna know fly, I wonder. Probably nothing. Zapdos, okay. Um, so, what, what did we do? We just stayed out. No. Um, okay, so we're gonna stay out for one turn just to trick it into using Thunder. I mean, I guess it doesn't actually matter either way, we can do it either way. So it's 
please don't go and waste it. Which is functionally the same as just switching out before, so I'm not really sure why I bothered, it, but it's fine. Oh shit. Um, it might outspeed me now. Okay, I'm gonna put up the substitute now. It does. It, okay, so I just need to swap the order of my actions then. That's fine, I guess. So now it'll move second and walk straight after it lands. That's fine. It doesn't really change anything for us. I think it speeds everything else in my whole party anyway, so this is fine, right? I think that's gonna take four hits now. Which we can do. We can do four hits as long as they'll hit. four subs, so should be okay, right? So this RNG is on our side here. Give me a crit, give me a crit. I sure would love a crit right now. Don't need one, but I always like him. It's good this thing doesn't know, like, I don't know, any non- electric moves that aren't fly. I would be in trouble if it did. Maybe it's AI is just locked into fly for whatever reason. I'm fine with this though. I'm not fine with missing though, that's kind of bad. Um, Stinkachu knows quick attack. So if I, even if this doesn't finish it off, I should be okay. I just finished off with Stinkachu. If this had missed, though, I might have been in some actual trouble. A little trouble, trouble. Alright, good. We crit it anyway. Nice. Good enough. Good enough. Right, I think we just switch back to old Stinky now, right? Let me see what he's bringing out next, though. Gligar. Um... We bring out Dominic for this. Okay... Single ice beam should be enough, as always, I think. Great. Oh, and a crit. That thing didn't stand a chance. We probably did like twice its HP. Yep, swap back out to Stinkachu. Who will eventually reach all of 50, I hope. Being sure one of these guys actually, so they get like some of the bonus XP. Okay, he's gonna hit 50 on the next one though, I think. This Pokemon is still too off too. This going is fine. One or two Thunderbolts should do here, I think. Alright, this is very Metroid to me. Don't know what exactly. Maybe the Metroid Cry, actually, I'm not sure. That's fine, just Thunderbolts again. I don't think this thing can one-shot me. And it might- Okay. Well, it does still get to go first with that, though. Almost surprisingly. I don't think Skarmory is a very quick Pokemon, is it? Being a tank, I would assume not, but... Maybe it has a decent speed stat, from all I know. Alright, nice. Finally. Dodrio. Nope, stay on out. It's fine. You can do it, Stinkachu. The wind is finally with my flightless bird Pokemon that has no wings and no arms. Poor Dodrio, how does this thing even survive? It's not the Pokemon Center. Why do I keep doing that? I think, like, I must be confusing the town with the town that has a gym layout that 
like that, like the Pokemon Center, up to the upper right of that. Maybe a uh, Vermillion, granted there quite a lot. Uh, I just want to check something real quick. I want to see if any of the Pokemon in my party, uh, specifically the higher level ones that I'm using right now, get any good egg moves that I could teach them. Be those tutors. is kind of useful, but I'm probably too smooth green for it. Additional power, huh? That's not bad to know. I mean, I already have Rock Slide, though. I don't know if what the BP is like. I'm mostly concerned with the BP, really. Pursuit is okay to know, but I don't think it's going to be too useful. Unless the NPCs in the arena switch out a lot, I guess. How much does Rock Slide do? Can I just check in here? It did a TM, right? Uh, there it is. 75. Okay, it does more than Ancient Power. I think Ancient Power's stat raising chance is really low, so I'm fine with this. I guess I'm not really too concerned with you guys yet. But maybe we should take a look. So we'll bring it 16. I speed at 43. Definitely going to need those egg moves. Toxic, huh? Okay. I'll hold off on you since I'll get the full thing once you're evolved. Okay. So, no big rush. I don't know if I really need any more leaves for anything, honestly. Um, hmm. I don't really know if my team is ready to go back and try Sabrina again yet. These guys are still useless. Um, Stinkers is getting like two, maybe three levels at most. Alright, um, Faster would definitely benefit from some XP. I think what I'll do. Get soft sand right now, right? We'll take that off for now. So we're going to take it off of Celia and leave us the way he is for now. He can keep the XP share since he's at the lowest level. We can give you XP share to faster as well. And we will go to Jasmine's gym. Now, I believe one of the perks of fighting Jasmine, if memory serves, is that she's the only trainer in the whole gym. So there's no trainers to have to trudge through. Not like it's a big deal, you know, like it's it's EXP. But I think you get more from the the gym leader in general, so. Alright, she's up here. Okay. Yeah, I'll just put her right up to 12. I can also put them up to 13 if I want. Uh why not? Why not? So 13 is super this level, so this is going to be pretty difficult as far as levels go. Good fast just up front. That's what we want here. Oh, I'm more than ready. Bring it on. She doesn't have a full party of six, she's only got five. Weird. It's really strange. Let me just earthquake this thing. Small chunk of EXP though. Blastoise? That's that's not steel type at all. Get that out of here. Don't just specifically bring stuff that'll counter like what your gym is good against. Rather what your gym is weak to. So it's kinda silly. Game wise it makes sense, but Pokemon League wise, I don't think that's really how you're supposed to do things, is it? Falcon has got a stupid Gligars too. Why does it know Earthquake? Uh, oh, I survived. Wow. I am stunned that I survived that. I wonder if I could have used Fly Spam against it. I wonder if it would have just Earthquaking. 
question. Right, can we switch back now? Yeah. Good. Okay, back a little faster. Donald is also getting a Steelix. But faster is, I think, our best bet for Super this Gym. So, I'm gonna try to focus on him whenever I can. I guess it is going to have high physical defense, isn't it? Ow! Whoa, what the hell? That's not good. Um... Alright, we're going to switch and have to sacrifice Cindy. She doesn't have any XP show on her anyway, so my logic is she wasn't going to get anything out of this battle anyway. So the least she can do is take a hit if needed, basically. I wanted to bring out Donald instead, but I don't want him to, like, take a hit and get softened up right away. I don't like if he could survive one or two. I'm gonna try Surf. So at speed, at least. This thing's up 62. Ouch. This is a big Steelix, let me tell you. Alright, that's considerably better. We'll do that next time if we do this gym again. We probably will. Let's see, if we had, like, more Pokemon pulls available, she could just pull out a Ridge Steel here, which would be kind of neat. You should run rock side. It's actually rock type, so it's got stab. It's nice. Here's a leer. Nobody needs leer. And gross. Again, also not the appropriate type, but I'll let it slide since it has like lot significance to her. Sure. Sure, there goes any points. In her party, end up at the top of the White House at the same time, huh? Oh boy. Mm. Rip. Okay. Hmm. Might be in trouble. Um, I'm tempted to just revive here. I don't think a quick attack would be enough. I, I think I have to revive. I also need to buy more vibes, we only have two. Okay, in the long run, they're relatively cheap. You know, like, 1,500 or 3,000, I think 3k? Oh, nice, okay. Um... I wonder if I can outspeed. I'm just gonna try a quick attack, I don't really wanna risk it. This thing might not thunder anyway. Okay, that must be low accuracy. Nice. again? No. No such luck, but that's fine. We gotta whittle it down, I guess. Get back with the faster. Let's try to quake it. It's got a good accuracy. On TPP. Bug, steel, right? No flying aspect to it, despite the wings, I don't think. Okay. Hmm, looks like bug resists, um... Ground. Unless steel isn't weak to ground like I thought it was. This ain't great, though. Donald might be okay here, though. Bam surf. Strong move. Nice stab. I think Donald... I think he's still holding Mystic Water, right? I don't think he's got the Twisted Spoon on because I saw that in my inventory. No, don't crit, don't crit, don't crit. Okay, we're fine. Nice. This is a bit messy, but probably worth it, right? Like, just doing this gym a few more times, I think. I think we'll probably just do that. Not bad. Three. Good, he's, he's getting up there. He's growing up fast, growing up strong. Growing up right instead of growing up wrong. Alright, let me go heal. If I can... I'll get lost, that is. 
Let me check and see if this all revives at the mart here. If so, I'll pop myself off on them, I think. Ding, 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 ding. Pretty late in the game, they should sell them, right? They do. Oh, they're only 1,500. Very nice. Um, yeah, I'll spend all my money on revives, I don't really care. It's fine. Okay. And I healed up. So let me head back up. I'm just gonna do it again. But first, do let me go use the bathroom and grab some water first. I'll be right back. to acquire water to drain my bladder. It's a shame there's no one coming around to shit, shit with while I play tonight. But that's part of this. It's a grind, you know. Getting big. I'll do. Right, let's get those levels. Survives the thunder shock and only serves. But it's still our best way of starting off, for sure. Alright, it knows earthquake. Did we survive by just a bit last time? I hope we get lucky this time, too. I don't know how big the variance is in damage. Mm, okay, we're fine. Not great, but fine, you know. Yeah, fly spam wouldn't really work, I guess. It would still hit us after we come down. So, the uh, the feather shift like that is definitely the best bet. Alright, so Donald is better here. Donald's it is. Um, it's not like Faster is getting all the XP. Uh, I kind of wanted him to, really. I'll focus on just leveling him up, but... She just has to have a team with some stuff that he's not amazing against after all, so... Quick. It's gotta be a nuisance, huh? Ah, just a little bit more would do. Yeah, yeah, do a stupid earthquake. Ruin the gym, collapse the whole town. Ow, don't crit me! Oh boy, that's not great. Faster can finish it off, but... 
not having Donald for that um, Scizor is going to be a problem. Also, Hyper Potion is also a problem. Wow. Wow, Jasmine set a really good example here. I mean, I would do that too, but it's not my goal to set an example. It's not my job, I'm not a gym leader. I'm just here to beat you. Or try and fail, I guess. Ooh, ooh, Revenge Crit. Oh, you've got to be kidding me. No. Why? Jasmine, you're a bitch. <laughs> the hyper potion into an explosion. That's just mean. Well, my whole party's pretty much gone now. So we got some XP. That was the goal, I guess, huh? Um, Thunder Wave? <laughs> I think all I can really do here is hope that it, like, gets a bunch of bad paralysis rolls, but no, not a thing. Alright, Weaklings, do you think you can take on this level 58 Scizor? I think that's where it's at. Because I don't think you can. Prove me wrong. I dare you. Too bad this is going to one-shot you. But you put a pretty good fight, Cindy. That's some pretty good damage. I mean, I think Scizor does have really high physical defense, but probably not very good special defense, right? So, not a big shock, but I'm surprised to do that much despite the level diff. Aurora Beam. I don't know how this interacts with Steel or Bug. Not very well. Growl it, but like, what's the point? It's not like my less than level 30 Larvatar is gonna be able to do anything anyway. Oh, or are being gonna make a tack fall? Uh, since when? That's weird. I didn't know that. Uh, maybe I should just use rest, but mm, I feel like it wouldn't have helped. Use a revive on Donald here, I think. Should have just done this sooner. Uh, earlier on, I was kind of like resigned to just losing the fight, but well, I feel like I shouldn't now. Mm. Nice crit, asshole. Oh, that's- that's not Donald. I didn't res the right person. Is this gonna be okay? Um, I'm gonna fly. We've got leftovers, so this will help us get topped off a little. Right, so that's neutral damage. Ooh, paralysis. Nice. He keeps on failing that paralysis check. This will work out well. I'm assuming that Steel probably needs his slide trick, so... I wouldn't really do all that much. So I'll just keep on doing this so I can top off with the leftovers. Cool, huh? What's our last Pokemon again? Ooh, nice, that scissor's worth a lot. Oh, it's Ampros, right. to it, right? Oh, okay, well. That definitely lowers our odds of winning. Um, I can just revive uh, faster, I guess, huh? That's okay as well. Security. Um, let's just use Thunderbolt. Or not. No, neither of us will do anything, actually. I think this is probably my best bet. Like, if that thing knows thunder and I use fly, I'm screwed. This isn't really gonna do that much, but... Slowly whittle it down. I 
If I get knocked out, I'll just earthquake it. It's good if I can soften up a bit, though. Oof, I'm now confused and paralyzed. That's pretty bad. Come on, come on. Leftovers keep me going. Stinkachu, then. That's fine. We, I think we can just take that out with an earthquake now, right? For sure, right? Get all the XP, too, which is pretty good. That's what we want for faster, after all. Nice. Nice. Almost up to 54. 55 was kind of the goal that I threw out last time, but I ended up not going for that because it took a bit. But maybe we should go for that this time. I don't really know. Maybe there's another gym leader we could fight and have a better time with. Jasmine isn't awful. It is nice being able to like, reach her so quickly. Hmm. Surge is still an option. Kind of a boring one. I fought him so much already, but sure. Let's go see Surge. Report in. So maybe get a quick security save since I've been going for the over an hour. Yes. Yes. And on that note, since we do have to fight at least one trainer to reach him. Usually went through the guy on the right, right? Can't really recall why though. I'm, I know there's a few electrodes in here. It could have been a nuisance, but hopefully we can outspeed and one-shot them so they can't self-destruct us or anything silly. But I think the one that really gave us the issue the self-destruct were the Weezings and Koga's gym. Not Koga, Janine's gym. But previously Koga's gym. The gym previously known as Koga's. Why does Gregory have five Pokemon? His party is literally the same size as Jasmine's. He also shares a Pokemon with her. And I can't one shot it. Impros is pretty tanky, huh? Beats me too. No, no way. Uh, but why? Great, I just got all the XP. I guess that's fine. That's an interesting way to give them all the XP. Still. Saying that he actually still only gets the XP share portion, doesn't he? He doesn't get like in battle portion, so it's not really that great. It does still get wasted partially, I think. We can still paralyze this, right? Yeah. Pretty good thing, too. I'd like to bring out Donald and Surf on this. I just kind of need to hope it doesn't use an electric move on me. So we're just praying for good luck here. I'm gonna try and attack 
that's fine. Let's get him into non-type. It's just normal. They burn me though. They just surf. This is the best part, right? Good. Nice crits. And the jewel to the finish off both, huh? Okay. Back up a stinky shoe for a moment, I think. Why can't I just teach stinky shoe earthquake or something? Maybe I can. I don't know. I haven't tried. I'm not going to. Yeah, we'll just start with mutually trying to paralyze each other here. Mutual status ailments. Then I, I might as well just stay out against this, right? I guess Surf would still be pretty good. It'd probably take it out from half HP or more. But still. Please don't make this take longer than it needs to. Uh Please don't use that every turn. Okay, good. I mean, that's only gonna slow this down more, though. So maybe not good. Okay, it does no thunder, so I can't really use fly. Good to have that confirmed. It's pretty powerful. I know thunder is quite a lot stronger than thunderbolt, but I don't really want to have to deal with the reduced accuracy. Beautiful. I benefit from that because of leftovers. You know, considering the damage Thunder did, just keep on using Pin Missile. It's fine. I'll wait. Maybe coming to Surge's Zoom was a mistake after all. Maybe the trainer on the left would be a better bet to walk by instead of the guy on the right. I don't know. Attack it now. No. No, we're not allowed to. Absolutely not. What absurd suggestion. Fine, what a nightmare. That trainer, he could just open up his own gym. We would be happy to have him, I'm sure. They seem to like people with self destructing Pokemon. Obnoxious status ailments. Over to the left? No, up the left. Okay. I would say, yeah, I'll it eventually, but I won't. I really won't. There's too many towns. I'll never remember these layouts properly. Like, yeah, I have a rough layout of some of the towns in my head, but I often forget where the center is. Pokemon Center. Alright, um, while I'm here, I am going to check out this guy on the left. So I know in case I want to do Surge's Gym again. This will essentially tell me, do I want to do Surge's Gym again after this? Like how quick it is to get past this guy. Check my fortune. Well, he starts with an Electro. That's a bad sign. Is this just going to do what I think it's going to do? No, it's going to use Light Screen. Wow, what an idiot. I'm pretty sure he meant to select this explosion, but his Christian wants to uh, move a little bit. He's, he's got Joy-Con Drift. I don't know why you'd play this game with Joy-Cons, but there's nothing stopping you if you have them set up. Just using good old keyboard. Now he's got a smaller party, but he leads with electrodes. This one is even more likely to use explosion. Eh, I guess not. I figured since the last one said the light screen, this one would use explosion, but, you know. He's just going for swift. Okay, I do need to keep in mind, faster is stronger than this. He just has the XP share instead of soft stand on right now. He normally does more damage. Three electrodes. I mean, I can one-shot all of these at least, so that's really good. It's just, if one decides to explode on me, I'm in big, big trouble, you know? I 
Ooh, they don't know explosion. That's some real wishful thinking, though. They give a decent amount per, and I can just one-shot them, so maybe I should just keep fighting this one trainer. <laughs> I would like to check out Surge 2, though. I don't see why not. which is my arbitrary goal for him. You are overpowered, but is your Pokemon more underpowered? Okay, great. Alright, let's just ignore the third guy here. Wait, Surge. Stand up and face me. Yes, positive force. My favorite Street Fighter song. Alright, good, we can one shot at the right shoe. That was all sandy one. Very nice. It's worth less than the electrodes, though, despite being higher level. Weird of that. type move on faster, but I feel like Earthquake is strong enough that we're still better off using it. I don't know. Let's go lower defense, right? I'll, I'll try it out, just because... Wow. <laughs> it, that, that's all it did? What? <laughs> um... Well, this went to shit pretty quick. How much is Earthquake gonna do? Why is this thing's defense? Um, let's get a hyper beam again. Switch up to Cindy, I guess. I assume it's going to hyper beam again. It's gonna be awkward if it doesn't. Okay, it did. I'm gonna finish it off now. I think in Gen 1, wasn't there a bug where if you successfully killed something with hyper beam, you wouldn't have to do the rest turn? I'm pretty sure that's fixed in here, though. Whether it's fixed in Gen 2, or specifically in Crystal Clear, I don't think it's a thing. Anymore. Yeah, thank goodness. What an awful bug. Unless you're the player, in which case it's a great bug, because I think it affects you too. shot me anyway, right? What is it gonna use? Maybe like it's dream speed? Wait, rain dance? Oh, it's gonna use thunder. Oof. I think that specifically buffs thunder explicitly, right? Like only that move? As far as electric goes? I'm unsure. Mm. I'm scared. Thunder's gonna hurt stink too quite a lot, I think. I'm scared to bring out Donald and Surf. I, I can't really switch into him. I wouldn't want to risk, like, two paralysis things. I'm just going to use Thunder. This is going to be bad. Okay, it's not that awful, actually. Oh, Thunder can paralyze. Huh. But it means that I can't fly. I kind of knew that. Um, 
This is still published. Ooh. That's not thunder, that's hyper beam. Which does more damage. So why did you bother using thunder? Okay. Can I surf? Like, I, I need a lucky paralysis check here. Or oh I cannot speed because he's slowed. Right, paralysis. Okay. Uh this probably won't be enough. But two hits maybe, buffed with rain dance. Yeah. Rain stopped. Shit, I was afraid of that. Uh, I have to try it though. Oh god, he had to recharge that turn anyway. Let's see. Beautiful. Great, okay. We survive for now. It was his fourth, he's got two left. Oh, that's rude. I'm so scared of himself destructing. But I'm still bringing it faster. We might be able to one shot this. Oh, it's only level 56, like the others. I think we can. But it might outspeed me. No, okay. That was my real fear here. Speeding me and using Swift. Okay, nice. Five down, one left to go. What you gonna pull out now, Surge? Like to buzz. Ooh, right. This was pretty strong before. Maybe I'm thinking of um, Wayne's Magma, but I think it's worth a ton of EXP, right? It's level 62. The Beast. This is the real leader of the pack, not Rykel. It's well one shot, right? Oh, it will. Nice. Mm, it was not actually worth that much. I remember Magmar being worth disproportionately um, high XP compared to the rest of Blaine's team, but I guess that doesn't carry over to Electabuzz. Strange. Okay. Nice. That was rough, though. I gotta say, that was really rough. That's just 55 now, right? Okay. So... I'm not entirely sure if we're ready yet, but I think I'm ready to try Sabrina again. Get an idea of where we stand. The power balance. No fewer than fly back on over to Saffron. do here is upper left, lower left, and then down. Yeah, I actually remembered it. I'm impressed. I remembered three consecutive instructions. I really have come a long way, haven't I? See how it goes. Let's go into this kind of fresh, right? How many hits from Earthquake? Two. Two will be enough. He's a psychic though. We don't have anything that's good against that, right? I remember doing quite a lot of damage. Oh shit, right, that was quick attack. Oh. Oh. Okay. That's my dog. Ignore that. Son, oh, this SBN sucks. That's why I kind of wanted a dark type. Okay, that was lucky. That's not going to happen every time, though. I don't have a good solid strat for that yet, but we can at least see the rest of the fight, I guess. Mr. Mime, huh? I don't think we 
Ugh, I don't think we really have anything good against Mr. Mime either. Cool lava does not count. Wait, is Mr. Mime actually he's just pure psychic, isn't he? I'm thinking of um, Jinx, which is ice and psychic. And of course, Galarian and Mr. Mime, which just doesn't exist yet. So we're even more screwed against that then. Stinkachu is just a good kind of all rounder who has a bit more beef behind him. Maybe he's gonna be the star of the show. I don't know. Psychic hurts though. It's real bad. Just have to hope that it gets paralyzed this turn. Mine, Mrs. Mime, Miss Mime, Ms. Mime, Madam Mime, Mistress Mime. Uh, oh boy. Oh, the same usually fast, right? Am I screwed? 62. Here it goes. Maybe we really do just need to power level Lavos. Okay, defense, fine. Shots for Pokemon Go. As if those are what I want. Pokemon, go home. Pokemon, get out of here. Go away. You're drunk. Go home. Ghost, huh? Wish we could teach something here. Shadow Ball. I think we can if memory serves, though. Let's see. So, Psychic isn't gonna work on my boss, right? It's Bite. It's technically super effective. Wait. Oh, it must not be Dark type until it finishes evolving. Hmm. I just could not recommend Serebi, like, right off the bat. Biased against him. I just wanted to double check the type thing. Okay, Tyranitar is rock dark. But until then... The line is just rock and ground. Okay, that's why. So it has to be fully evolved if I want to use him. Which happens at level 55. Ouch. Hmm. Maybe I should just, like, solo focus leveling him? Not an awful idea. Wipe me, wipe me, wipe me faster. Okay. So, tentative plan here. Um, I'm going to do a bit of leveling from Lavos. And then check out the underground arena. And not actually finish off Sabrina today. That's my current tentative plan. Um, so I want to get him up to maybe 40 or 45 today at least. So I think we're just going to go back to Surge's gym with Faster. Um, but wait, we need something that we can switch out against safely. Uh, so actually, we're better off using Stinkachu in Falcon's gym. Alright, we'll just do that I think. See why not? Yeah, I think that'll be fine. We could even go to Blaine's gym if we wanted and use um, Donald instead, but I think those will be okay. Just okay. So 
I don't want to just grind today, nothing else, you know? Okay. You are not what I wanted to examine. Friend. Friend. Mm -hmm. We'll still put it up on sec 13. I don't know how doable it will be if we're switching out all the time, but we don't always have to switch. We can just maybe do that on occasion. We'll see. Oh, so I changed the music before. But I changed it for Joe Canto, so now we actually get the new music. That's cool. Uh, oh, why do you no pursuit? Okay, I survived somehow. That's nice. Okay, so Furo's can no pursuit in here. Good to know. I'm gonna assume that that's the only Pokemon here that will, but I don't know for sure. The question is, how did it know? Like, did the AI just use it by chance? Mm. Kinda sus, you know? Very sus. Actually, don't really like the word sus. I'm getting sick of the whole Among Us craze. It's not for me. The sus I know is from old YouTube poops. We then loop a character's audio so it says, Sus. See, a totally different kind of sus. I like that sus. I don't like the suspicious sus. I liked it back when it was a nonsense word that meant absolutely nothing. music. Crash. I don't really think we need that. Unless it's a like, dark type or something. Let's see what Cerebi says since I have a page up. Uh, it's just normal type. It's pretty strong. I mean, it's better than some of the trash that's on here now. So sure, we'll get Risk Reach and Favor of Crash. Maybe if, like, there's no good move to use against something, it'll be good. I don't know. Probably not. I'll commit to going at least up to level 40, maybe 45, depending on how quick it goes. And after that, I'll go check out the underground arena. Chikotobijo. That is probably not what it would be called, but it's valid enough. Listening to Japanese act, though. Please. Just praying that nothing uses pursuit. I can survive that first hit from the fear every time I come to the gym if I have to, but anything more than that's gonna be kind of bad, you know? How much is this gonna do? Mm, it's fine. I can take another hit from that even. Maybe even a third, if left over is healed for enough. Nice. Must you waste my time like this? Skarmory, please. Don't risk a quick attack. My Skarmory will do like 2 damage. I'm getting there. Slowly but surely. Okay, cool. Mm -hmm. Congratulations. 
congratulations. It's gotten kind of ugly. Mm, yeah, I need to heal. One moment. Don't go up to Bellsprout Tower or whatever that place is. Not this time. against me. Come on. Come on. Come on. I like Toad's voice line in Mario Tennis. He's got the same line in uh, Super Mario 3 v World as well. You pick up the start of the level. I love that. Alright, switch out. Don't autopilot and accidentally just let Lavos perish here, please. The world will end, but not yet. <laughs> he's not ready, he's he's still growing. Still incubating, okay? Okay. Ooh, that wasn't enough. Ouch. Alright, we we can definitely quick attack that though. I have no doubts. Good. For once quick attack does it. Yep, swap out real quick first. Pupitar's um, little sprite there looks really weird. The in menu one. It, yeah, it's just strange looking. Looks like it's a head. Instead of like the little cocoon thing it is. It's not that absurd that that be the case, considering it is basically just a face plastered on a shape, so. I guess. Ba -ba -ba. Let's take a two-minute gain a few levels from this, too. I want to use an overstatement, like one, maybe two at most. I consider a few to be three or higher. I think that's what everyone considers it to be, but I don't know, sometimes you get people arguing about this stuff, right? <laughs> As a kid, I was under the impression that several was used for seven and above because it had like seven in the name, but as an adult, I realized that's kind of dumb. Okay, rip stink at you. So, is it normal in flying or. Let me look. Look at it. I'm just gonna go on Cerebi since I have it up. Uh, it is normal one flying Gen 2, yes. Okay. So, I think we ice beam it, I guess. Makes sense, huh? Perfect. Level for Donald? No, no level for Donald. Levels from Abos, stealing them all, robbing the earth of its precious nutrients. It's almost kind of a shame that it doesn't temporarily become like bug ground as Pupitar. I mean, it would just be like a neat observation kind of thing, not anything that would really affect gameplay because. I don't really think anyone's going to use Pupitar competitively, but it's been kinda cool, you know? Mm -hmm. I don't know of anything else in nature aside from bugs that uses that kind of thing. Alright, we need to go heal up again. Does this suck? Yeah, it, it does kinda suck. Maybe I should just buy shit ton of rare candies. One is like 450 coins, I think. I'm not exactly sure how that converts to money. 
Let me deposit my money so I can keep it in case I, um, wait out here. Since that could be delicious real candy money. With 150 coins, I think that makes them around 4,500 poker dollars each, which isn't great. I could get like 20, which I guess would get me pretty much up to where I need to go. Um, do Pokemon still evolve if you use a rare candy on them at like the intended level in Gen 2? Or does it have to be an in-battle evolution? That's something I actually don't know. nothing here if we wait so it's okay it's perfectly fine all right that's fine right, if you're gonna do that i'll just do the same thing you set your yourself up for this pidgeot you damn fool <laughs> okay sure I guess if I could get him up to 35, I could buy 20 rare candies and just get him up the rest of the way. It is definitely an option. Uh, I really can't, like, switch out from Zapdos, I don't think. Alright, so for Zapdos, we stink at you, right? Uh, Aster's good too, because Rock Slide does a ton. Um... Paralyzing it first. You know, I think I'll just bring it faster and start rock sliding. It's only faster has that many other uses in this fight anyway, right? So. Right, good. Maybe it'll use agility instead of fly in the first turn. It does that sometimes, so. Ooh, flinched even better. Right, rock slide could do that. I keep confusing it with Rock too, which has a chance to slow. Or might always slow. It's me. Okay, nice. Free win against the Zapdos. Cool. Give me that. Give me that EXP. Ooh, not enough. Doesn't matter though. Three flinches in a row. What's that chance? Like, uh, one in three ish? I mean, still though. Um. I think it's gonna fly now, right? Yeah, so I'll drop a sub. Sorry for the sniffle. Someday I hope to sniffle no more. Okay, that was pretty clean. All it took was one about sub damage. Almost gets big gains from that, but not a level. Not a level. Shame. Alright, we'll bring out Avos and swap out off of here. Not really deflated of Gligar. Donald is ideal. It's ice Beam, as we always do. Yuting? Yeah. Oh, missed, so that's okay. I say the accuracy of those moves is a little based, right? Like, I think they get a big penalty if you're below your opponent's level, so he'd have decent chances of hitting, I think. Or maybe they don't go up higher, maybe they just cap out at, like, whatever they cap out at. I'm not sure. Uh, actually, no. Firo probably knows Pursuit, so let's not do that. I don't know what the odds of it happening to use it are. Unless the AI is specifically programmed to cheat there or something. I really hope not, but let's take it up normally with Stinkachu here, I think. 
speed level to this thing that speeds me. It's not sp Mistake. Not looking good. As a kid, I think I sometimes got drill pet confused with horn drill, just because I had drill in the name. I was under the impression that it could also be a one-hit kill move. I think I saw it in a later gen and it wasn't. I was like, wow, they changed it. Weird. of me being a dumb kid that came to Pokemon. At the very least, I wasn't one of those kids that couldn't find out how to get out of the, the bedroom at the start of the game. You know, uh, one of my best friends didn't know that you were just supposed to go down on the, like, or rather, I, not the bedroom, I don't think, but the, uh, the house, I think. I, I forget. Maybe it wasn't even Pokemon I'm thinking of. But some kids didn't realize you just go down to the bottom, like where the doormat or well, carpet thing is, and walk down. You know, like I guess I can get it as a kid, maybe. But I would think you'd like try stuff, right? Like just hit the buttons, do the thing. Maybe not. Hmm. Nice being a little bit better here, I think, actually. Try this beam next turn. I'm also gonna, gonna get flied upon though. Should be that much damage, right? Yeah, we're all good. We can take another one of those if we need to. Hmm, now surface more. Oh, right, still must resist ice then. Okay. That's fine then. Let's go with the surface stab instead. Oof. Stings a little, gotta say. Is that the whole fight? Yes, it is. Okay, so I can say one thing for sure. It's going to take an like absurd amount of time to get to run a terror. At level 55 at this rate. So we're definitely going to have to get some more candies. However, I would like to get just a little bit higher. Like, maybe just one or two more levels. I'm still thinking 35 would be good. Then I can get 20 rare candies. I actually think I have a couple laying around, too. How close are you to the next level? Fairly close. Um, yeah, it sucks. Let me go do a battle with the, um, first trainer in here again. Since he's got, like, five Pokemon in his party at level 13. Gym level 13. Just, uh, I'm gonna take a hit from Pursuit if the Fuhrer decides to use it. If it does use it again, like, right off the bat, I'm going to suspect that the AI cheats. If it doesn't, I'll talk it up to coincidence. Hmm. That's looking pretty dirty. I think it actually reads your move there. Specifically in the case of Pursuit. I'm gonna look that up later. I gotta wonder. Like, I'll look it up right now. Pokemon AI Pursuit.
I'm finding people talking about, like, Pokemon AI doing really stupid things, but... Can't think anything about Pursuit. That's just because, like, it's too to write out layouts, hiding stuff. Uh, yeah, switch, switch, switch back out for sure. I wish this test would just go on its own. Swap back over to Donald. definitely some interesting stuff to read here that regarding the AI cheating, so I'm interested in that. Uh, not done. Oh, I should have swapped out the lab first, actually. I wasn't sure where I was in that whole mess. I forgot, honestly. Okay. It's okay, though. After this battle, I'm going to go dump my savings into a bunch of rare candies. Let's see where we're at. Mm, level 52. Tasty. I know this is going to be a bit weak and you basically have any EVs, but still. I'll take what I can get, you know? Having a dark type, that's just like and evolution line strong. Eevees or not is gonna be helpful, I think. Yeah, you know, my, my team is probably pretty Eevee starved in general, actually, because I haven't been fighting wild Pokemon for a long time. Now, and I know it's not just wilds they give them, but still. I've only been fighting gym water trainers recently as well. I'm trying to get as much EXP as I can in as few battles as possible. So, I'm sure that, like, my mains are probably fine, my main three. They must be like, probably maxed out by now, right? But any new ones must have like next to none. I'm actually not sure though, like, um, if they switch in for a turn, do they get the EVs? Or do they need to be the one to finish it off? Or like, be out when it faints? I'm unsure of that. I want to say they get the EVs, but I could misguided on that. I can't remember. It's not a question I've asked for a long time. Alright, heal up real quick first. I mean, I know that I can buy, like, the, uh, EV adding items as well, and maybe I will. Maybe I will. Maybe we'll make this into a really good Tyranitar. I didn't even check what its DVs were like when I got it. Uh, okay. That's, that's pretty good. It's pretty good. Aside from the loose speed, but oh well. Why is it already so happy? Happy. Cool. Okay. Alright, so. As I was saying. Um. I don't really think it matters which one I go to, right? Again, I'm assuming that the exchange prices are the same. Get a messed up if not. I'm gonna draw some cash, as well as any rare candies I have sitting in my PC. Not sure if they're in here. I have one. Um, let me take this charcoal. No, no, I'll take it out another time actually. Okay. Bank account. 
account. Withdraw it all. I'm not necessarily going to spend it all, but take it all out anyway. I can't be asked to get that last 98 bucks. Okay, so let me just confirm here. I know the other one, I'm pretty sure they were 450, right? Okay, it is. 90, I guess? Okay, that's probably the same at both, right? Sure would. So I could buy that many. That's less than I hoped I could get. That's not great. I want to save a little bit of money afterwards. I don't want to spend everything. That'd be kind of silly, I think. So I'm going to spend 100k. Go check the other place to make sure they're the same exchange price for their candies. 490. Before I do anything here. Uh, so it it was Celadon, yeah. I was just confused before. I did end up finding it right away, right? Just by mistake, kind of. It's like right here. This is the exchange corner. Yeah, same price here. Do one at a time again, huh? Ugh, this is so expensive. That's all we can get. How many is that? Twelve. So we need to get it up to uh, oh, 43 first. Mm. That's going to be a while. That is not even that close. Okay. So, quick diversion before I resume grinding, I think. Let me go check out the underground arena. So... I believe where this is... I'm going to... Saffron. I believe the underground part of Kanto, like the underground paths that lead from city to city, have been repurposed into a bigger area that contains the underground arena. Um, right here, right? Yep, okay. Thank you, Wednesday, Friday. I think will be the days that I do this. So I assume I go down here then. So it's 3k to enter, maybe there is a prize of some sort. Well, first things first, let me put my main 3 Pokemon up front since I'll be using them. I we have good items on. So what's this PC have then? Already healed. Set rules. It's fine. Sure. Stand. Keep it at zero since I don't really know what I'm doing. Okay. Hmm. Okay, so it lets you have all six Pokemon. It's weird. Rather, I'll, I'll just change it to a uh, both, right? That'd be fine. I figured it would just have me throw three in there. Okay. Fuck's sake. I think I should just deposit it. He's rest band. That's the wrong PC. Okay, so we get in there. Oh, come on. One thing after another, huh? Let's 
it's just gonna tell me you can't register without six, so I'm gonna have to withdraw one. I'm predicting it, but I'm not going to like act on that until I know for sure. Deposit. Alright, set the rules. Both, yep. Okay, we're good, apparently. Arena, okay. Thought this cost three, cost three K. I mean, you said amateur. So I'm gonna assume amateur. Why would they shut down battles? Oh, I guess this is the guy, actually. Okay, let's go in. No regrets. So we're starting now. Okay. It's not gonna be that intense. I see some Pokemon in the crowd. Anything goes. Mr. Leong. Leong. Okay. Oh, that's, that's some nice Mega Man Battle Network music there. <laughs> Just noticed that. And here's more Battle Network music, I think? Sounds like it. And Cloyster. Well, 55. I thought it was going to set him to 50. Okay, it didn't level me up with that, which is kind of shit. Ground is good against ice? No, 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 no. No, ice is good against ground, idiot. I have, I have to switch. I have no choice here, really. Otherwise, I'm totally screwed. You want to say this is like a Final Balls theme from Network or something, isn't it? What are the games? No, the other ones, maybe. Can't recall for sure. Okay, nice. We do get EXP. Oh, that's nice. Hmm. That makes this kind of appealing to just do then, maybe. I don't know. We just fly here. May as well, since it's strong against it. Yeah, you better not hit me with Toxic. Break off those eensy weensy spider legs. This is here with leftovers after all. I just quick attack after this. I'm not sure yet. No need. No need either way. So does this guy have a full party of six? He has five. It's the same as me. I wonder if it matches me on purpose. That's that's kinda nice if so. He's got a Pikachu, huh? Okay, I think I'll just quick attack. Stats are pretty bad. Yeah. Yes. Okay. There's no Eeveeoy in Gen 2, is there? Was that introduced? Maybe Gen 4 or 5? I've got no idea about that kind of thing. Must you paralysis me? I don't want to be paralysis Center we've seen, I, I don't think it ever appears at night, so I don't think we've ever seen it. And it's like literally Gen 2's Rattata as well. That's why I don't like the real time clock, at least not for like my purposes, you know. There's so many Pokemon that we never really got to see. Like, no wonder I've been not in the mood to wander around the roots and like look at stuff and catch stuff and fight while well Pokemon. It's such a small selection because a lot of them don't come out during the night. Oh. Hello, my clone. You may have an advantage right now because I am paralyzed. 
but I don't think this guy has EVs. Not a few of it. I mean, I do have this in difficulty one, so I guess it's gonna be kind of easy. Wasn't sure exactly how easy it'd be, but so far, pretty easy. Maybe quick attack is better? I don't know. Yeah, Thunderbolt's pretty good, I'll just keep doing this. Is he using Thunder Shock or Thunderbolt on me? And just Thunder Shock, which is a tiny thunder Thunderbolt animation. This guy doesn't know. By the TM, wherever it is that I got it from. What's this Pokemon for? Is there just one left now? So, do I fight more opponents after that, or is that it? I have no idea how this works. One point. Okay. It's one consecutive win. It's a boy call. Okay, so I just keep going. Do I keep going until I lose, or... Like, is there a certain amount? Like, is this 16 people, so I'll be doing four matches? I have no idea. Bean boy. Or will the Toga pee? Doesn't know what's coming. I'm assuming I got healed up after that too. It'd be kind of asshole if not, right? But not until I see Stinkachu though. Please no. No kiss. No chew. Don't chew, chew me. is getting some XP from this. I am appreciative of that. What's gonna happen when Pastor hits 65? We didn't get healed. Wow. That's mean. Maybe they don't care if I'm overleveled for this. Maybe it's fine. It's clearly not totally in the spirit of fair play if they're not going to heal me up after. Like, if this is a bracket tournament, I can only assume that this kid fought someone else before this, right, to get here? If that's the case, why is his party fully healed? Like, yeah, I got lucky Stinkachu stayed at full health during that, but keeping prowess is still kind of ass, you know? So I see the support forces on the uh, no switch rule. I think we're hearing about that, or also what you have it set to. It's fine. Doesn't really bug me. Set and slip switch, I believe, is what it's called. Saw the XP from that. Alright, we get another level for Lavos. I didn't know that that would be like something that we could do here. I'm pretty happy to know that. Alright, swap out to Donald. Strength there. Don't bring your HM slave to the battle arena. Such a rush to keep playing, he just always hit B after every fight. 
He stopped so many evolutions without even realizing the mistake he was making. How could I? Wow. So that's two points. Wow. Gentleman Hatcher. And the giant egg. I don't think he was listening. Do I get a chance to, like, stop after five battles or something as, like, a break? Because I don't want to go forever, forever, you know? That'd be kind of butts. Why do they keep sending out stuff I have to switch out from? Actually, I, I can just use Rock Slide. That's fine. I guess I didn't have to switch out last time, did I? Sword stance? Wow, how dare. Poor pets. Poor pet stance. It looks really, really ugly when they make that into possessive. Kinda hard to say, too. Poor pet I don't know. I'm missing too many teeth to say that kind of thing properly, I think. It's it's a magic card. It's literally a magic card. You gotta be kidding me. Type advantage or not, this probably doesn't know any moves, so I'm just gonna stay out. Okay. Great. Look at that EXP. That's pitiful. I mean, type irrelevant. I can probably just like one shot anything that's not evolved with faster, I think. Let's go to the stat diffs. Ooh, I'm a champ. Oh shit. That's a bit more serious, though. Well, I think time to use Earthquake. Always a good time to use Earthquake, really, right? Aw oh, man, it's got a barrier or something. Mm -hmm. It's probably gonna hit me and take me out in its turn, isn't it? Stay alive. That's fair though. I've got soft sand on, so it's totally fair when they have a berry. You know? Doesn't bother me. Yeah, we'll just quick attack it. As long as paralysis doesn't screw us over, we're okay, right? I wonder if you can use items during this. I doubt it, right? Since it's supposed to be like a competitive battle. But you see that the option is there. I wonder what happens if I select it. Switch out the Donald for this. This faster's gone, huh? Mm, should be one shot, probably, right? generous it would reduce the party size of a future opponent to match my fainted party, but it probably won't do that. No, I probably can't. My party's taking some real beatings here. Three points. Wow. Gentleman Virgil, another gentleman. Gentleman's club, huh? A blue haired guy. He's gonna run hog wild. Is he? He's a bit old for that, don't you think? I shouldn't judge. Not as I play spring chicken anymore myself. The overweight age of 28. Oh, shuckle. Uh, fine. The shuckle again. Bug and rock. So this will do neutral damage, I think. It's gonna do like jack shit though, it's got high defense. I'm bothering. Switch out to Donald. At least he didn't punish me for that. I mean, buffing its defense is kind of punishing me, but not when I'll be using Surf. I don't care. That's fine. Use safeguard. Just, that's, that's okay. I don't care. 
I'm gonna surf. Probably one shot, right? We'll have a ship with special. Oh, shot goes low HP, so it was a good one down. Oh no, it survived. And it's still using defense curl. How strange. Very, very strange. Poison until Crobat, I don't think, so we'll just use Surf. Ice Beam would be super effective too, but still. Can't help but notice that uh, the Pokemon here leveled up to match the max level of my party now. So the 56 is at 55, it's faster than leveled once. So I guess that's how that works down here, huh? I did notice there was a level match thing too that wasn't turned on by default. Right, now we use Psychic. Survivors are paralyzed. That sucks. Oh, this is probably gonna take him out, right? No. Okay, good. Made it to the paralysis check, too. Lucky. Decent XP from that. Something. We are definitely getting more from gym leaders than just the higher level, but this is a nice uh, variety thing. So do positive damage. So it helps. I'll get neutralized out against the water now, but... Ooh, very nice. One left. Crap dash. Okay. Well, I could one-shot this, but that's only if it lets me attack. It's charging Skull Bash. So, this will probably take it out, right? Nice. You messed up, gentlemen, whatever your name was. Let's get the XP to Virgil. Hog Mild. Ooh, that's a good one. You're really laying them on me, Virgil. Alright, that's probably the last trainer I'm gonna beat. Oh! Wow. That modifies two. Okay. Huh. This is that after every four wins? Well, shit. Great. Keep going. Rough rules. But let me grab some water real quick. I'm thirsty. One moment. Versatile rule changes. Uh, earthquake is good here. Let's do this earthquake. It's fine here at least. Earthquake is always earthquake, you know. Great move. Beautiful. Polytoad. That's not so good for me though. Alright, we have to switch. Please don't hurt stink at you too much. Don't hurt him too bad. Nice. Unlucky there. Got speed, thankfully. Two to three of my top party members are quite fast. Donald's like kind of neutral speed, probably, but 
Staying attuned faster or just quick as well. Really helps. Okay, what do you got next, Rita? Rocket Rita, right? I don't think it Yeah. Good. Yep, no. Thunderbolt it. There used to be super scared, right? Take a few hits though. Meditate. What's, what's meditate do? A attack up? You sure you really want to do that? Is that really worth your, your turns? Poison gas. Okay, well, you missed. Is poison gas physic or special? Poison is physical. Okay, so we've always gotten buffed, but I mean, you meditated again. You don't have to really do anything without meditate. The stat buffs went to waste, Rita. No wonder Team Rocket went under. The trainers like you stinking up the place. Right, so I was up to 38. How many candies did I have? I think 12 or 13, so we've got a ways to go. No, I don't need scary face. suggest doing such a thing. I want Shadow Ball. So many Pokemon can run that recent gens, can't they? This guy's gonna take a few hits. Maybe I should have swapped that to Donald. Just use Psychic. Ooh, wow, that was strong. He must be spec for offense. I think Monk usually is anyway, isn't it? Do that much. Oh no, you've got to be kidding. <laughs> that is some real bullshit. Alright, well, Master is essentially our last party member left now. The others are still way too weak to make any difference here. I mean, maybe if they use the not fully evolved ones, but even then, honestly, like, mine aren't fully evolved yet either, so. It's not gonna go very well, I don't think. I might be this trainer. And I might not, I'm unsure. I think they have one Pokemon left, right? As long oh, that's actually it. Okay, nice. I was gonna say, like, as long as it wasn't a direct counter, I could take it on. Alright, two points. We got six points. I wonder how many is for the actual prizes. Fisher Hughes. So I think Rocket Rita was supposed to be like a boss or something, right? That's why she had her own music, and that's why it healed me beforehand. So it's not that it's after every four battles, it is, but it's because there's a boss every five battles that they want to prepare you for. I see now. She wasn't really any harder than any other trainer. I mean, yeah, I did get more wrecked by her than the others, but that's only because that muck blew up on me. Oh no. I gotta sub this. Otherwise, I instead I. Honestly, this thing is a, a real, really direct counter to faster. I'm not gonna make it through this, I don't think. I'll go ahead and struggle and do my best, but I think it's just gonna take me out. It probably knows Giga Drain or something, right? It just hasn't used it yet. Now the best I can do is just keep on Earthquake and subbing. Sub quick. Good job, Kagi Bunshin. Good job, Kagi Meat. Let's check the battle network called that, so that's probably the more appropriate one here. Okay. Uh, no. We can take it out next turn, too. Mmm, that sucks. That's gonna heal quite a lot, too. 
That crit was really fortunate, but it not using Silver Beam this turn is really unfortunate. I don't think we're gonna get to do anything here. Maybe it'll like waste a turn charging up. Okay, it did. It did. I don't think we can take it out. Let's see. Maybe we'll get it weak enough that um, I suppose I'm gonna finish it if it Silver Beams again. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Okay, I'm gonna sack Labos here, so Cindy can have another chance to hit with something instead. And it means Labos gets no need speed, but it's fine. Let's get as far as we can here. I think this is the strangest first Pokemon, though, so does it really matter? At least Cindy will get EXP. If, and only if, this thing uses Silver Beam again. Yes! It was stupid! Rather, its trainer was stupid. Brilliant. The 25 level difference upset. Give me at least a full level for that, come on. Ah oh, man, look at that. Not even a level. Oh look, Pupitar. <laughs> Why do these trainers keep on bringing out my Pokemon? It's not the second one, so it's it's just odds being odds. You will what? Holy shit. Hold on. Wow. I'm gonna make a note to myself to grab that for the thumbnail. That- that is just brutal. <laughs> I cannot believe it. Blue's knocked out of the ring. I mean, I jumped out, but yeah. Alright, so. I got- Six points for that. This is tutorial, man. I mean, I didn't get a chance to forfeit. Oh, you can only do this once per day. Oh. Hmm. Must be the person. Uh, wow, that's pretty. Pretty high cost there, I gotta say. Wow. What the hell? Okay, I'm never getting anything from here, am I? I mean, like, I, I get it, I would have to set my thing up higher. So I can't I can't go in again today, right? I will scale. Okay, so that that's what gives the most XP, I guess, which is what I have on. Anyway, I don't think that I can go in again today, right? I don't really want to, man. It would take too long. Is there anyone in here to talk to, though? Oh. Fine. Bouncy uses bounce. I just want to talk to people. I'm lonely. This is gonna bring me out somewhere else, huh? Yes, yes it is. Okay, I, I see where I am. So, how many candies do I have? Twelve. So that would get me up to 50. Okay. Well, that isn't exactly good enough. Um, but I said I would go up to 40 today, so I will still do that. Let me grab Celia back out. And do some battles here, I think. Um, yeah, let's do this. Swap out faster after. Again, I want Celia in the party, just so I have a full party. Who are you? He's Carmen San Diego. How's the Stinko? Uh, he's doing pretty good. He's, what, like level 50 now? Uh, today, he's level 53. I've been grinding up for Sabrina all day. She's still too strong. Um, I decided my main party of three wasn't really cutting it, these guys. So, I bought a Tyranitar from the game quarter, and I've been trying to level him up. Not the Tyranitar, Larvitar. But he doesn't evolve until level 55. It's pretty harsh. I spent some of my money on rare candies at the game corner. But I could only afford 12 total. And that means I still need a few more levels before I can, like, rare candy him up the rest of the way. It has been a very slow grind. Uh, you must be checking out the arena. It's like this uh, underground thing over in Kanto. With, like randomly generated trainer sets. Somewhat randomly, I assume. It was pretty cool, but I guess you can only go in there once a day, so I can't go in again for the day. 
Alright, so. Right. I'm here to grind on Surge for a little bit. Yeah, I can't wait to get Typhal Illusion as well. Oh uh, yeah, just cancel the other challenge. I think that was on Falcons. Typhal Illusion, I'm probably gonna want to level up. Um one of the other gyms, but I'm not going to be leveling, um, or up for this one. So if she gets a bit of EXP here and there, it's nice, but not the main focus right now. I specifically need Tyranitar because he's dark and rock, so he's immune to all the psychic moves in Sabrina's gym, which should be a big boon, I think. Yeah, I hear red is really, really strong in here. I'll gladly give him a shot at the Elite Four. I hear you can also re-challenge the Elite Four and they get much, much higher leveled. I would like to do that stuff. I think today, um, my plan is, since it's been going on for quite a while, to get Lavas up to like level 40, then probably stop there for the day. And next time, I'll handle getting him up to 43 or 45 ish or whatever, and then use the red candies to buff him up the rest of the way. This boy today has just been a grind and a half. Been so slow. Level curve is pretty harsh at this point in the game. I can't even one-shot this guy. That's with soft sand, too. Decent points there. Two more levels left and we'll be content for the day. So just this fight and then maybe Surge should be good. As long as I don't get self-destructed on. His HP is already pretty high for his level, huh? As expected of something that becomes such an absolute beast. Should have named him Unit. So we're just gonna grow up to V. Still not 39. Oh, no, 39. Good. Thank goodness. Hanging back out. If I wanted, I could buy a few more candies too. It's not a bad idea. I do have some cash left over. I spent a hundred thousand polka dollars getting the coins for 11 more candies. Maybe 10. I had like one or two in my inventory and in my, my PC. So I'm not exactly sure how many I got, but... Not enough, let me tell you. I made pretty good money from doing gym refights, but... Still. These things are expensive. Gotta save some money for TMs too. Uh, yeah, sure, we'll just switch like usual. It's fine. Even though this one is factually the one that can self-destruct on me. I know, it's done it before, but... I don't care. Just walking it anyway. Okay. He's just gonna let me... Oh, no, he's gonna do it. Okay. means that, uh, I always get all the XP, right? Delicious. Works for me. Alright, 
Let me go heal so Faster's alive again. Make him reconscious. Surge. We might actually not beat Surge, considering his party's pretty strong. He's got a like level 62 Nyko in there, but still. We'll knock out whatever we can. Do whatever needs to be we can, I guess. To do this whole battle, it'll definitely be enough. Over 40, I think. Yeah, this Pokemon should actually do it. Nice. Maybe we'll hit 41. As if we're to do this whole battle. I don't know, I think switching out every like, KO like this is really going to hinder us in the long run there. I'll keep on doing it. I don't really mind. Oh, 40. You know, actually, I, th I think we'll grab Cindy some EXP. She could use it. Assuming it's 32 for type illusion, right? If so, this will work out well. Ouch, I forgot how much this poor gun to hurt. This thing is strong. Mm. Uh, I can't sub this, sadly. I just gotta do this for damage. Let's switch out to stick at you and finish it off, it's fine. Actually, we could actually just finish it off with Cindy. It's gotta be charged, so sure, I'll do that. Give me the big XP. Give, give, give. Stuff it down in my throat. Right through a straw. Yes. Unnecessary crit, but... Shows that she has a promising future. Pretty screwed against an electrode right now. Mm. I don't know if this one self destructs or not. I don't think it did it last time, but that doesn't really mean that it doesn't. It just means that it didn't. I mean, I one shot it last time before it could do anything, I think. So. I don't need with Thunder Wave. It could outspeed me. That's one thing. Mm. I don't want to use Fly to interrupt the rollout. I'm just afraid, like, if it knows thunder, I'm screwed. It's going to try to use thunder on me on the air. Oh, it does. It does. Okay, I can't do that again. Though, interestingly enough, since I move first, it can't, like, predict that. So maybe I'd be okay, but I'm just gonna use thunderbolt, I think, for now. It's fine. This is pretty good damage, actually, yeah. It's more well, honestly. Yeah, it looks like it's a good thing they didn't fly again. I would have gotten, like, insta guild there, probably. There it is. There's the explosion. Thank you, Surge. 
Thank you for your daily dose. Okay, bring it down a didn't great, but we'll do it. If I need to, I do have revives. I could just revive faster, I guess. Might have to. Just surf, I guess. I mean, we're not gonna get to surf. No Kawabunga here. Not today, Captain. Alright, um, bring out Cilia and we will res faster. And Earthquake one shot this thing. I would say, in a sense, it's practically not worth it. Because you, you could argue that we're paying 1500 golds for the EXP from this thing, which isn't much. But at the same time, if we beat Surge, we get like 5,000 Poké Dollars, roughly. So it's worth it for that. Like it's missing. Nice. So I'm also buying a victory here. <sighs> Don't mind me, I'll just keep on doing this. We're gonna be here for a while until Aurora Beam finishes it off. Tickle fight. There we go, finally. Shit, I forgot. We hadn't dealt with it yet. Last time he sent out the Electabuzz last, but not this time. Oh boy. Uh, can we even outspeed this? We can. Could we one-shot it? Probably not, right? Mmm... No, not quite. That's probably gonna take me out. Yeah, no! Ooh! Faster held on! And then switch so used a hyper potion. But that's fine. We can't attack this turn, so we can just use another one next turn. Use another earthquake. That's okay. Alright. That was some crazy luck. This thing will give me a ton of XP, right? Yeah, it's it's a bit more than average. Yeah, C6200 Poké Dollars, it's worth using a revive for that, I think. Alright, so I think that'll do for the day, finally. We're still not ready for Sabrina yet, but tomorrow... Um, I will get Tyranitar up to 55, rather, I'll get Pupitar up to 55, where it will evolve into a Tyranitar. Lavos will hit his final stage. Hug Cindy. I can do that. Aw, that's cute. It's happy, and I don't get set on fire, surprisingly. Okay, thank you to anyone who came tonight. I should be back on Wednesday at 6pm again, if all goes well. I'm going to head off, have dinner, and watch true crime documentaries. Have a good night.